In this video, you'll see why Presto's out-of-the-box results make it the fastest way to give your green screens a web GUI that can be accessed from desktop and mobile devices. For some of your screens, the out-of-the-box results that you see on the left here are all that are needed. For others, this is just the starting point. And from here, you'd use the Presto Visual Editor to add new functionality like drop-down boxes, charts, and much more. Now let's go take a look at the immediate results you get with Presto without even touching your screens. Right when you install Presto, which only takes 15 minutes, it automatically transforms all of your green screens into web pages. You start by selecting from the pre-shipped skins that control the look of the screens and which you can completely customize to match your company's look and feel. Your end users only need a browser to access the screens. There's nothing else that needs to be installed on their PC and all popular browsers are supported. Presto also runs natively on IBM I. There's no Windows servers or other servers required all of which really simplifies deployment. Right when I log in, you'll see that all screens are instantly transformed, including system screens, menus, and subfiles. This is possible with the 5250 approach in Presto because it automatically intercepts the data stream and renders it as HTML. That's why Presto supports any RPG version in COBOL and no recompiling is required. You don't even need the source. Presto includes a lot of default styling and navigation improvements. It automatically detects your page titles and transforms them into a nicer font. It also detects your function keys and transforms them into nice side menus that are also most clickable. The same is true for your menus. It automatically detects those and turns them into clickable links. All of this improves navigation for your end users who prefer to use their mouse. It does many things for subfiles as well. It automatically detects them and puts them in nicely styled tables with alternating row colors. And it detects the subfile options so your, your users can hover over the input box and select the action that they want to take. It's also important to be aware that Presto supports your original IBM I navigation as well. So they can use their keyboard to hit things like an F4 lookup window. But they can also continue to use their mouse and click the buttons that are also automatically detected. Presto has excellent window rendering. It supports all different types of windows and you can also then drag them around the screen. Another nice feature that you get out of the box with Presto is you can access your list of spool files from any screen and then users can click on a spool file and go to see a PDF version of it within the browser. You often have hundreds or even thousands of green screens you want to modernize. Presto has many global configuration options so you can make changes across all those screens without touching them. For example, you can choose to position the function keys as buttons on the bottom of the screens instead of to the left. You can also change the input label text to be left justified or even keep the original dot 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 styling. And you can create custom rules for your own unique screen layouts. Our customers have used Presto to modernize thousands of screens, but it is not an emulator. These are real web pages. And while the vast majority of them will work out of the box, you should still test all of your screens before moving them to production. And any that don't render correctly can often be fixed through proper configuration settings. Because you don't need to change the source with the 5250 approach in Presto, your green screens are not affected in any way, and users who prefer to use them can continue to do so. The modernized web versions do retain all the IBM I object security, and you can also use SSL to encrypt data as it travels from point A to point B. Presto also offers support for mobile devices out of the box. It automatically detects if you're on a mobile device, or it hides the header to maximize screen real estate. It puts the function key buttons in a nice flyout menu, and includes a virtual keyboard, which is handy for devices that don't have function keys. There's also a native mobile version of Presto available in the App Store. What you've seen is how much Presto does for you out of the box. If you want to learn how to further enhance screens, such as adding images and drop-down boxes, you can watch our 10-minute tutorial on the visual editor at bcdsoftware.com 10. If you'd like to download a free trial, or if you have questions, please contact us.